Hey everyone, Shannon Morse with GeForce, and I'm joined by Greg to talk about Asus's new Tough Gaming monitor, the VG27AQ. So what does Tough Gaming mean? Tough Gaming kind of evolved from just motherboards to now an entire ecosystem. So Tough Gaming, we have displays like we're going to talk about here, but we also have chassis, we have keyboards and mice. You could build an entire Tough Gaming system if you want to. Now you've introduced something very new and kind of revolutionary in a way to this monitor, the ELMB Sync. Yeah, so with this display, the ELMB stands for Extreme Low Motion Blur. It's our low motion blur technology, but it also has the sync function. So it works with variable refresh rate technologies like G-Sync. And we're the only manufacturer right now that has that feature. In the past, you'd have to choose between low motion blur or G-Sync. So now you can turn on your G-Sync and low motion blur for just a great gaming experience. So I've experienced both, but never together. What does that look like? Well, you get all the benefits of G-Sync with no tearing, but the images flicker on and off. So it's just low blur. And because it works with sync, that flickering backlight will change as the refresh rate changes. So what are the other features of this monitor? It's a 27 inch display, 2560 by 1440. It's a 144 Hertz panel. You can actually overclock it to 165. It's IPS, so it has great viewing angles, great color quality. But you also get HDR10 compatibility. So if you're streaming HDR content, you can watch it on your system. And also, even with IPS, it still just has a one millisecond response time. Now, I do want to talk about some of the physical features of this as well. Uh, when I was playing with it, I really liked the menu. The yeah. joystick on the back makes it so intuitive. Yeah, that's something we've been doing on our ROG displays for a long time. And in the menu, you'll find a ton of really cool features. We've got Asus Eye Care technology, which is kind of a blue light filter. We all know that blue light can it make you a little agitated. Your eyes. Yeah, it strains yeah. your eyes. So having the blue light filter is good for extended gaming sessions if you're playing for four, six, or even eight hours if you're streaming or something. Can you tell me a little bit about the uh, other features that are built into the menu, like the crosshair? Yeah, we've got these game visuals built in, so you can put a crosshair in the middle of your screen. You probably wouldn't want to do it in competition. It might be considered cheating, but if you're just, <laughs> if you want to go around no scoping people, it's a cool feature. You can also even put a FPS counter on the display without doing it through software. And it has other things like if you're doing multiple displays, it'll put up alignment markers so you can have your displays perfectly aligned. And you have plenty of ports on the back too. There's display port. Yeah, display port and then dual HDMI. Well, that's exactly what I would need because I always use DisplayPort since I'm a big G-Sinker. Thank you everyone for watching this video. And of course, if you're interested in more NVIDIA GeForce content, make sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel. I'm Shannon Morse. Thanks for watching.